Welcome back to Afternoon Express. We're live on SABC3 and I'm in the kitchen with Chef Clem. Ready to eat? What are we making today? We're going to make a Fiorelli pasta yes. with mascarpone uh -huh. and some zucchini. Uh -huh. It's also foreign. So Italian. It's the only, only foreign language I know. <laughs> <laughs> Speak a little foreign. All right. So the Fiorelli is a type of pasta. It is. It's kind of got its name from the frills on the end of it. Kind clever. of like a flamenco's dress. Very clever. There we go. All right. But that helps us because it's that those frills that actually hold onto the sauce. Right. Perfect. So let's get started. Let's do it. So we, we're talking all spring vegetables because it's spring right now. Mm -hmm. So bring on the zucchini, bring on the fresh tomatoes, yes. and just get cooking. So we normally used to, to this, right? Yeah. Normal slices. Yeah. We're going to switch it up just to get some more texture in your food. Oh, look you know, at you. It's just like fun, like create Difference. more texture with your food. Yeah, I was already going <laughs> in my head. <laughs> yeah. All right, that looks so cool. Nothing wrong with doing the old like slice, mm -hmm. but this is so cool. It's just great, just like a million different sides of that, yeah. can, that can get crisp. That's the thing. Yeah. Yes. More surfaces, surfaces, more crisp. There we go. That's what we need. So I've got right? some extra virgin olive oil in mm -hmm. a pan. I don't mind cooking with extra virgin olive oil. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. So the baby marrow goes in. And our fresh, we've got some exotic tomatoes here today. Those colors look insane. And again, eating in spring or eating in general is all about color and color, texture. Color, color, color. Absolutely. So that's going right. to start cooking off beautifully. For how long? What you want to do is, okay, I don't mind my zucchini being a little crunchy. How yeah. about you? Would you like to cook through more? Cook through more. Okay, so you would let it go for about 10 minutes. Okay. Otherwise, like five minutes would oh, be good. so good. Okay. Oh. See, that oh. was just showing you. <laughs> you did okay. that on purpose. <laughs> so Are you not going to season that? No, uh, not absolutely. seasoning yet. I'm going to stretch over oh, now. I've okay. got some salt and some pepper. Mm -hmm. And it, just add it to it. Also, you don't want to add it in the beginning. The trick is when you do that, a lot of the natural moisture comes out of it. So you end up boiling your vegetables instead of frying it. Uh -huh. So let it first brown and then season Great your vegetables. Tip. Cool. And then I'm going to go with some fresh basil. I love basil cooked off slightly. The, the, the flavor develops so amazingly. Mm -hmm. And then to cut this, just tear that in there. That mm -hmm. goes in. A little bit of chili. I like chili. That looks so yum. And it's, chili, yeah. lots of chili. I'm with chili. Chili, add more. Yes, perfect. <laughs> <laughs> so that's in there. Mm -hmm. Again, give it a bit of a toss. Bring all those flavors I mean, together. It smells so oh, good. It smells so, so good. so good. And then, of course, you've got to have a little bit of garlic in there because it can't be Italian Without, if it doesn't have yes. garlic. That's a lot of garlic. You, right. You're going on a date tonight? Uh, no. No, you, I'll be all right. You'll be all right. <laughs> so again, garlic's in there. Flavors coming together brilliantly. And as soon as it does come all together, mm -hmm. you grab your mixing bowl. This one the here? The big one. The big one. And this is why we're actually here today for these amazing mascarpone pots from Woolworths. Yeah. There's a whole new range of them. Okay. I'm using the pesto version today with a sweet tomato in there. Uh -huh. So again, half the job is done for us. We've got those extra flavors in there. But other than today, what would you use this mascarpone? Okay. In dips with bread, you serve it on a platter. You know, and that's why I kind of brought these guys over here. Oh, clever. Because it's concert season. We're all going to be out. We're going to yes. be at like amazing parks, having some amazing mm -hmm. summer snacks. Picnics. 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 It's a great picnic snack. It is. So you you take a, a crostini and then rub some. And you dunk it. And you dunk it. Can I dunk it? Go for it. While you do that. I'm also going to be using Farming. the crostini as kind of like mm -hmm. a, instead of parmesan that you top on the end of your pasta at the end, I'm going to be using the crostini for that. Mmm. But first, so, mascarpone goes into a big mixing bowl. It but, is so good. It's got a sweetness to it. That's the sweet tomato that's in there. Aha. Yeah. Big flavor. So in with our vegetables. Wow. Those have become delicious and creamy. Stop it. And what, because of the heat that's on the vegetables at the moment, it slightly melts the mascarpone even more. Okay. As you can see, it's kind of like, it's kind of gone a bit runny. And that's what you want. That's your sauce made. So if you can pass the Fiorelli. Do you want me to plonk it in there? Go for it. Mm-hmm. Obviously you'd let it, oh, oh you'd cook it first. <laughs> the Fiorelli cooks yes. off first. Yeah, and it's also <laughs> so quick. Mm -hmm. um, and the recipe is amazing. It's got that authentic, like, Chew to the pasta that mm -hmm. you must have. Got a beautiful platter over here. I mean, have you ever in your life <laughs> seen anything more divine? 
It smells so good. So while Clem does that, do remember that if you want the ingredients and of course the link to the recipe, all you need to do is SMS the keyword crunch to double three six five zero. Each SMS is going to cost you one round fifty, and no free SMSs apply. And are we going to garnish, make it look a yes. bit? I think we're going to add that crunch. Crunch. So here comes a crostini, like I yes. said, it's going to crush these over. Yes. And that's it. You got some basil there. Can I do the? Go for it. Ta -da! Done. Portion for one. Uh, <laughs> no, it's summer. <laughs> it's summer. <laughs> but in case you missed anything right now, here's a quick recap. <laughs>